welcome back my youtube family i'm your instructor my name is rashid today we are going to talk about an exciting topic donor charts in tableau these charts are not only visually appealing but also super useful for data analysis whether you are just starting with tableau or you have been using it for a while this episode will make it easy for you to create and understand donor charts if you are interested in learning how to break down sales by different brands or categories stick around till the end of this episode you won't want to miss this so let's dive into the chart you see on the screen what you are looking at is called a donut chart and it's just like a pie chart with a hole in the middle why do we use a donut chart well it's an excellent way to visualize the breakdown of a total into different parts in this case each slice represent a brand of product and the size of each slice shows how much the brand has contributed to the total sales for example in this case you can see Britannia has the largest slice meaning it has the highest sales with the value of 2602. Palaji comes next contributing 2583 to the total. Other brands like Super, Tiger, Rejoy, Cabin and Morning Cafe also have their own slices showing their contribution to the sales. And if you look in the center you will notice the total sales figure which is 7911. This tells us the sum of all sales combined for all brands. So this is how you can use a donut chart to represent your sales data by brand and analyze which brand leading or declining in the performance. We first need to create a pie chart as we did earlier in the previous episode. Go to the mark section and from here I'm going to select this pie chart then I'm going to paste my this total sales on this angle and then I'm going to paste my this brand on this color so the pie chart is divided into the sections with reference to the brands as you can see on this window then I'm going to select entire view to create a donut hole we need to add another chart on the top of this pie chart an empty circle will be in the middle of this pie chart so first I need a second measure to create another chart so I'm going to type AVG 0 this is for my first chart now I'm going to type it again this is for my second chart now I have to combine these both charts so for this I'm going to click on this chart and I'm going to select this dual axis and I have to hide this axis and now I have to select my this second chart and I will be removing the other stuff from here now I have to change its type from pi to circle and the next thing is I have to decrease the size of this chart of this circle because my main chart is behind this circle so I'm going to decrease its size and then from color I'm going to change its color to white now let's add some useful information to the center of this donut chart drag the sales to the label and then I'm going to select this label and I'm going to this alignment I'm going to select this center one and this middle one making it bold and size to 12 and now I have to type total sales with this so for this I'm going to select this one and here I'm going to type total sales apply and ok now we have to add the data labels on the main donut chart so for this I'm going to select my this first chart from here and I'm going to drag my sales onto the labels and the next thing is the brand names so I'm selecting the brand name and I'm pasting it on label I'm going to right click selecting this format and from these lines these are my rows making it none similarly I'm going to column grid line to none zero line to none so now this is looking perfect if you found this episode helpful be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel for more tableau episodes so thank you so much for your time and i will see you in the next episode of this incredible playlist goodbye